In this video, we're going to talk about the ellipse tool. Now, in order to access the ellipse tool, simply click on the arrow on the top left icon, and you're going to find the ellipse, which you can also use the keyboard shortcut O. Now, at this point, you can create an ellipse, and if you hold Shift, you can see that you can create a perfect circle. And as you create the ellipse, you can actually see that on the very right hand side, there is this small dot, which if you hover over, the cursor is going to change and you're also going to find the label arc next to it. Now, this means that if you hold and click, you can actually create a element which is going to be very useful for creating pie charts, for example, or even illustrations such as the good old Pac-Man. Now, jokes aside, you can actually uh, create also charts with uh, the ratio, which is going to enable you to easily add a empty hole inside of uh, this shape. So you can uh, easily see how you can uh, start actually creating uh, uh, different variations of uh, this. And uh, you can even create uh, charts directly <clears throat> by simply tweaking uh, these elements uh, and uh, you can start uh, adding uh, different uh, items uh, to the same uh, composition. Now, this uh, is uh, pretty much it when it comes to the ellipse. There isn't too much else uh, to it. Uh, you can also see all of uh, the uh, data and coordinates uh, of the start point uh, as well as uh, the sweep and the ratio on uh, the top right hand corner. So if you need to go really minute when it comes to the measurements, uh, you can easily do that uh, directly from here. And uh, I'll see you in the very next video.